Hello. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Okay. Welcome back to Intuitive 144 Tarot. Okay. This reading is going to be for all zodiac signs. Okay. We're going to see what's going on. I hope everyone is safe and been blessed. Okay. Today I had a um a, a beautiful day. Today turned out to be okay, okay? Like everything was on point. I went out, took care of a few things, and I'm just in a good spirit today. Okay, so we're gonna see what's going on with you guys. Make sure y'all support me by hitting that like button and subscribing to the channel, okay? This can have something to do with someone home. Whether you stay in like an apartment building, some type of resident, okay? Someone about to receive some type of gift. Okay, and it could be about someone merge and some type of community could be involved, whether that's family or friends. And a child. This can be either a physical child or like your innocence, okay? Someone could be reflecting or thinking about or healing their childhood wounds, okay? That has something to do with a home. Someone is also thinking about someone here with thoughts. There could be a masculine thinking of a woman and you do have merge here, okay? And we're gonna clarify. We're gonna clarify and see what's going on. Someone could want to offer you a gift. This could be your partner, someone you could be married to, okay? You guys could live together have kids or children with um, your partner. Clarify a uh, house, for clarify a house. King of Swords. Give me something else on house. Mm. I ain't lie, cards. You have a King of Swords. Someone that's um, very logical. Sometimes they could come off very right, cold or detached. Someone could have their guard up. 
okay? Dealing with a home. Give me something else. Spirit. Too many calls. There's too many calls flying out. Someone have a lot to say. Give me something else on this home, please. This community could have some type of involvement when it comes to someone merge here. Ace of Wands. Someone could have um, some. Someone probably wants to start some type of new beginning with someone here. You do have the merge card out, and it has something to do with a home. A home or some type of resident, okay? You have the Nine of Pentacles and the Hermit. Someone could be doing a lot of reflecting, a lot of thinking. Okay? Someone could just um, also just be holding back. Okay? And left out in the cold with the Five of Pentacles. Hmm. Is there anything else for this? Sir, what is this? Mm. Someone could be working very hard on their pentacles, okay? With the eight of pentacles and the three of swords, someone's heart was broken here with the three of swords. This king of swords is focusing on their stability right now, okay? And they are hurting. So it is like they work into... Take away the pain. It's like they try not to focus so much on this heartbreak. So they are putting all of their energy, their time and energy into their work. They are feeling very cold. And detached from a merge. That they could be in. It's something about. Some type of innocence. Someone could be dealing with. Some childhood wounds. Here. Here. Yeah, there was some type of major betrayal with the Ten of Swords and the Seven of Swords. A lot of sneakiness going on that caused um, someone to be broken on the inside. And whatever this heartbreak may have been, someone, their main focus and concern Right now is their finances. Is there anything else? Give me something on the three of swords. Four wands. A merge or commitment. A family union or dynamic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. A home was broken. Okay, a family dynamic was broken here. There was a lot of betrayal, a lot of sneakiness. Something broke 
Whatever this Ten of Swords is, this betrayal, Nine of Wands, burdens, it broke a family dynamic apart. And someone is hurt behind that. But they are working, you know, to keep their mind off of this betrayal. They are putting all of their energy, their time and effort into their money. Their funds, their finances at this time. Clarify, child, spirit, please. Page of Swords. A younger energy. Um, someone, it could be an immature energy, okay? Or, or a child, okay? Someone could be doing a lot of spying in. Someone could be looking you up or just, you know, reminiscing. Eight of Cups, someone is walking away from a family dynamic, the Ten of Cups. Mm -hmm. Someone is in major, major regret and crying. Okay, someone is very heartbroken. Very heartbroken. Give me something else on this shell. Spur, what is this shell? Mm. Eight of Swords. Someone was trapped in their head, in their mind. Someone here has um, or had a lot of um, mental things going on, mental entrapment of the mind going on because of this betrayal. It could be a younger energy. Okay, this person could be younger than you or you're younger than this person. Okay, someone that could be um immature with the king of the queen of swords here. Mm -hmm. So both of you guys have your guard up. Both of you guys are being very cold and detached from one another. Both of you guys are giving each other the cold shoulder. There could be a lot of um, slander going on amongst each other. There could also be a lot of name calling or even gossiping behind the scenes about each other. Give me something else on this chat. What is this um, Eight of Swords? Too many cards. Too many cards. These are a lot, a lot of cards. A lot of cards. Okay? A lot of cards. Something on this chat. What is this Eight of Swords on this chat? Someone is feeling very stuck. Very stuck here. This could be an older, you know, energy, but just very immature, very immature. The Queen of Wands. Judgment, hmm. You could be this Queen of Wands energy, okay? This 
page or this king of swords finds you very attractive. Okay, fire energy. Aries, Leo, Libra energy here. Judgment, the world, the star, the high priestess. Mm -hmm. mm. Give me something on this Queen of Wands spirit. Mm. Give me something on this Queen of Wands. Give me this Queen of Wands. Somebody got a lot to say today. The chariot, the nine of swords, the world, and judgment. Something is um, coming towards you guys. Fast movement, okay, with the chariot. Cancer could be significant. Someone was very stressed out about this. You know, someone couldn't sleep at night. They could be up all night just crying, stressing, worrying. About a new beginning with the world called. And judgment. There was a lot of mental confusion within this um, home, this family dynamic, and within this marriage. For some of you guys, um, you could be married or just in a commitment. Okay. Someone was betrayed. Betrayed. There was a lot of sneakiness going on within this family dynamic. And it could be from a third party. This could also be a, you know, someone that was younger. So, you know, someone older, but just acts very immature. Someone is putting all of their time and effort into their work right now. Uh -huh. Someone is going back and forth over a... Um, New beginning, about a new beginning or starting over with someone here. Someone don't have the strength. They don't know what they want to do. There's a lot of back and forth mental anxiety going on here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Someone was working in their devil energy. And what's so crazy about this, whoever um, in this energy, <laughs> I'm just going to say what I see. 
there's a devil energy <laughs> that wants to offer you some cup of love, okay? They want to offer you this new beginning. They're trying to gain this strength. Someone has very strong desires. There's a strong attachment when it comes to you and this king of swords. They want to offer you this cup of love. They are holding on to you very, very tightly, very strongly. They want to have some type of wish fulfillment with you guys. They want to take some type of leap of faith towards you guys. And whatever it is, it's coming in quickly. There also could be some type of fast communication coming in for some of you guys from this person. Give me something on gifts for it. What is this gift for? Yeah. Someone wants to offer you something. Two of Pentacles. Juggling. Indecision. It's like they um trying to make up their mind on whether or not to give you this gift. Mm -hmm. Someone wants to offer you guys something because they know you are the star. You are this high priestess. Someone is juggling right now. It's a lot of mental... Okay, it's a lot of mental. This person could be having real bad anxiety, anxiety within the mind. Okay, they could be stressed. They're going back and forth. Okay. And they thinking a lot about you guys. Okay, they really, really thinking a lot about you. Give me something else on this gift, please. What else? Queen of Cups. Mm. Someone is um trying to decide. Rather an, or not to give you or offer you this gift. You are the queen of cups. Pisces could be very significant. You know, you could be someone that's very sweet. Very honest. Very compassionate. Very lovable. This, this, this queen of wands is the third party. And... Third parties don't always mean cheating. It could be family, friends, you know. Sometimes people could give all their time into their friends, their family, okay? And ex-lovers or lovers. But, you know, I don't want people to always think it's always... A, a lover, okay? It could always be friends and family as well. They had a lot of input, you know, in your partnership or in your connection. Someone could be um, family and friends could be holding or was holding this king of swords back from you, you know? So it could be a lot put within that third party dynamic. That they put you in. Yeah, with the, the star at the bottom. Okay. For some of you guys, you could be um in the spotlight. Okay, working on a lot of new ideas. Two of Wands. Yeah, someone is um ready to, you know, look away, turn their back, and move on into a different journey on a new pathway. Mm hmm Because you're the high priestess. You are very intuitive. Very spiritual. 
Mm-hmm. For some of you guys, you could be working on, like, you could be a content creator. Or some of you guys, you could be a, um, a healer, a spiritual healer. Or tarot reading for some of you guys. Yeah. Give me something else on this gift. What is this queen of cups? And two of pentacles on the gift. Yeah, so someone is going back and forth in their head. They don't know, you know, whether or not do they want to offer you this gift or not. They're going back because their main um thing is their main focus right now is their finances. That's their main focus right now. Six of Cups. Someone definitely want to come in and offer you something. And it could be someone from your past. Past friend, lover, family. It don't matter. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because you all just wish fulfillment. You all just wish fulfillment. Okay? You all just empress. Okay? You turn your back. You looking away. You waiting on your ships to come in. Someone could be traveling towards you guys. Or could be at a distance from you guys. Okay? Or someone could be coming towards you. To offer you this gift. Because they know you all this wish fulfillment. Which is this nine of cups. Mm-hmm. Someone is definitely holding on to you very tightly. Very tightly. It's like, it's hard for them to let this connection go. Whatever that betrayal was, it's like they still finding it very difficult to let you go or to let this connection go. Anything else for on the gift? like the tower something was not built on stable foundation something came crumbling down in this connection in this merge in this commitment in this household family dynamic whatever this may have been something came burning down The truth. Spirit said that's the truth. Okay. Some type of clarity came out. Oh, a family dynamic. Ten of Cups. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Five of Wands. It was a lot of, um, it was very chaotic. Okay. This home, this, this merge. It was out. It was out of stress going on. Okay, it was very, very chaotic, and multiple people could have been involved in this because you do have community right here. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Anything else for? And it's also like someone is upset. Someone is so upset and stuck in their head. It's like they, it's like they know that they messed up by putting you in a third party situation with the three of swords and his king, king and his queen of wands. They know they messed up. Now it's like even though they focusing on their finances they are still spying on you guys secretly mm -hmm. and even though they wanna they still kind of up in the air with things on on whether or not to give you this new beginning or have this new beginning with you. It's like they want to rush in, but they still in their head about this. They still doing a lot of thinking about this new beginning with you. Give me more on this for this is 
이게 Five ones. Someone here could even involve a lot of people in this. And a lot of this was going on behind the scenes that you had no idea about. Every, you know, it could have been, look, you, once again, this, this queen of swords is you, you guys energy. You're no longer putting up with this mess at all. at all it's it's like you could have said something to this king of swords and whatever you said to this energy they got very upset about it it could have said something harshly right back to you. But whatever you said to them, it hit them. You told the truth about something. Whatever you said to this person, it came to light. But they would never tell you that. They would never tell you that. Anything else? What is this five on one spurt? Anything else? Something on this merch. Four five merch. Clarify merch. Ten of Swords. A major, major betrayal. Mm-hmm. A major betrayal. Mm-hmm. And mm. Mm. <laughs> someone walked away or is walking away. Okay. Somebody turned their back. Third parties, mm -hmm. out chilling, hanging with family, friends. Was it paying you no mind? Forgot they was married. Living their best life with no care in the world. Being very, very immature about this whole situation. They thought they had a cake. Okay. The icing, the candle, lit, blow it out, relight it again. They thought they had it made. Clarify this ten of swords with this merge card, please. But it was something that you said that still stick with them to this day. Mm-hmm.
pentacles they was given they was busy giving to someone else it was not equal it was not balanced at all they was given to family friends or lovers that's the betrayal that was the biggest betrayal mm-hmm They was being very selfish. This is a very selfish individual. Someone that's um full of themselves. Someone that's very self-centered. Okay. Someone that can be a manipulator and a narcissistic individual. I'm letting you know. Someone here was very, very full of their self. Whoever these other uh, family or friends or lovers were, they was feeding this king of swords energy. They was feeding them um, they was feeding very low vibrational energies is what I'm trying to say, okay. This, uh, yeah, they was very, very low vibrational. The more the outsiders was given to this king of swords, it, this, it made them feel better about themselves. They did not love you correctly because they did not love themselves. Okay. So when you're dealing with low vibrational people, okay, what you put out is what you get back, okay? So that's why they was busy giving to someone else or peoples. It could be multiple peoples and was not given to you because they was feeding their ego. They had a big, big, big ego. Okay, very, very, very low vibrational, very, very low vibrational energies here. Anything else? Spirit. I got a big ego, such a big ego. Yep. Mm -hmm. Someone had a very big ego here. Mm. Queen of Swords. Yeah. You could have said some words to this person. I'm telling you, say something to this individual. And then, you know, when all of this or betrayal, whatever this was, came out, when you found out you instantly became detached from this individual mhm mm three of pentacles seven of swords mhm mm behind the scenes collaborating you feel me saying just just they could be doing, a, they could have gossip, did a lot of gossip behind your back. Even this person that you considered your partner did a lot of gossip behind your back. They would never tell you though. Mm -hmm. It was a lot of sneakiness going on, a lot of deceiving, a lot of lies, a lot of cheating going on behind the scenes and the multiple people was involved. <laughs> But you may have blocked them or got them blocked. You're standing your ground. You're no longer putting up with their mess. And everything that they did to you, they're going to have to eat it. They're going to have to eat it. Anything else, Spur? When this came to the woods? Mm hmm. Their ego was so big, they thought they could have their cake and eat it too. 
okay? For some of you guys, if you're married to this individual, okay, they wanted to stay married and still do them on the side as well. What did I say? They wanted that cake and eat it too. King of Wands, fire energy. Aries, Leo could be very significant. Okay? This 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 um energy is strictly all about passion, working off their wand, you know, just going around just giving it away. Okay? Quote unquote big D energy. Big that's because they had people in the background feeding them their their ego. Okay? Okay, I'm just saying. I'm I, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it real with you. Okay. They was in that energy just going around, horn around, okay? Yeah, they strictly just was just working off of passion, an uh, inner out energy. Someone that like the parties, it party a lot, okay? Entertain people, places, and things, okay? Someone that like to come and go as they please. Someone that is very, very immature, very immature. Mm-hmm. But you, you could have blocked this person. I ain't lying. Nine of Wands and the no energy. I ain't lying. Mm-hmm. But you standing your ground. You no longer putting up with that mess. You turn your back and you walking away. Anything else in this spirit? cups walking away yeah do something on this community clarify this community please knight of pentacles Someone um, was busy giving to this community. Whatever little they did have, they was given to this community. Mm -hmm. Five of Cups. Now someone is in major, major regret. I'm talking about they are hurt. But they ain't got nothing to do with you. Mm -hmm. You have someone that's coming in. Okay. Um, they want to come in to offer you guys something. Okay. They want to have this um, wish fulfillment with you guys with the nine of cups and the six of uh, uh, wands. They want to have some type of victory and success with you guys, okay? It's a night energy. They don't have much to offer, but to each his own. Just understand, you know, for whomever this read may be for, just understand what they had done to you, okay? Yeah, they are rushing in. Someone is rushing in, and it's night of swords. Someone trying to rush in and take some type of action. Mm. Yeah. You um y'all finances are looking good too. Very good. Mm hmm Y'all have a financial blessing coming in. Whatever you guys is working on, um, is definitely coming in for wishing with this ace of pentacles. Okay, yeah. New love is coming in very quickly. I'm um, very quickly. The ace of cups, eight of wands, fast, fast communication, fast action. Something is coming in 
very, very quickly, a new love, a new offer, a new beginning, okay? Someone could also be coming in to um, apologize. Give me something else on this community spirit. Yeah, and major regrets. Lots and lots of regrets. Mm. Moon. Yeah, a lot of secrets. Death. Something came to a complete end. It's over with. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Someone had a missed opportunity or could have been rejected. Yeah. But the, <laughs> they are manifesting, you guys. I'm just letting you know. They are manifesting you guys back. King of Cups, the Sun, the Magician, and the Temperance. Okay? They know they they know that you made them happy. They know this can be a successful um partnership okay they are manifesting you i'm just letting you know they know this or you you know would make them happy but um they still deciding on whatever anybody else on this five of cups i'm in this community please They definitely thinking. They doing a lot of thinking about you guys. Okay? They know they messed up. They know about all that. Yeah, the lovers. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Knight of Cups. Someone is um coming in to um make you an offer. Okay. Gemini could be significant. Okay, Scorpio, Aries can be significant. Mm. Spirit boat, burp. <laughs> Anything else? Spirit? All this. Oh. Justice. Yeah. Justice has been called, okay? Libra energy, Knight of Wands, this in and out energy. Yeah, this in and out energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, something is over. Something is over. Something is over. This person can't seem to make up their mind, okay? Not at all. Let me see if, if there's any more messages for you guys. Hmm. Communicate, compromise, forgive, Work it out. Okay? So maybe y'all need to learn how to communicate. <laughs> King of Swords, Queen of uh, Swords. Yeah. <laughs> y'all definitely need to work something out. It, I mean, if you want to. Everybody have a free will. Okay? Everybody have a free will. But if this person was to decide to come back to make some type of love offer or some type of gesture of apology or something, okay, maybe for some of you guys, maybe you do want to work something out. And for those who don't, don't. Everybody have a free will. Okay? But even if you choose to move forward, like move on without this person, forgive them. Forgive them for you. Okay, and just move forward. Anything else, for mm. 
give it time. Everything in divine time and let things flow. At the bottom, challenges. Make a decision. Work on in an inner healing. Okay? Yeah. Anything else for this? So in divine time, and like I said, everybody has free will. You know, you, you could be still healing. This individual could be healing and just strictly working on their finances. Okay? So if you want this individual back... Is is it? It comes in divine divine timing. So okay. So this is just a time for you to work on yourself and just pour strictly into your own self. We need to let each other go. Okay. Okay. You and I were too young for some of you, okay? Y'all could have been very young when y'all got together or married, okay? I wish I could share my good news with you, okay? Someone could have good news, but they um scared to, to share it with you because of the situation, okay? Because of the lack of communication that you had with each other. For some of you guys, you could have this person blocked or this person could have you blocked. I hope that you can forgive me one day. Okay. Someone hope that you can forgive them. Anything else, sir? What's on my mind? Any more messages? Mm, that flew all the way over. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> okay. Hope. I haven't given up on us yet. So, like I said, someone is still, you know, trying to make that decision. The two of swords and the two of pentacles. Someone is still up in the air. They going back and forth on this. Okay? But I, I definitely would not recommend anyone to... Hmm, how can I put it? If you're healing, okay, and you're focusing on yourself, you're pouring into yourself, good things are happening to you okay you forgave this person you forgave yourself there was a lot of childhood wounds between the both of you guys okay there was a lot of lack lack of communication lack of giving okay like i said to each his own everyone have a free will okay but to wait on someone while they get their stuff together is something i i wouldn't recommend for myself so i'm gonna speak for myself They had an opportunity to come together with you, and, and but they chose to give to other people, places, and things. Reunion, we will always come back to each other, okay? So this person think um, that y'all will come back to each other, okay? Y'all need to um, compromise, forgive, okay? Work it out. Give it time. Everything is in div divine timing, okay? Of course, there was a lot of challenges, okay? Working on in the healing. They think you both um, are meant to be for each other, okay? Confusion. I feel unclear about where we stand. I'm telling you. And I'm leaving it as that. Because this person, third party at the bottom of the deck. There were other things that got in the way of us being together. And that's the truth. Okay? So, y'all stay blessed. Stay safe. Okay? Support your girl. Hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Help us grow. Okay? Help us grow. And I love you guys. Be safe out there. Bye-bye.